Today we are looking at classifying some of the quadrilaterals. So we've got a little map here and this big circle that contains all of these other circles uh, is the quadrilateral circle. To get in this circle all you have to do is be a polygon with four sides. That's all a quadrilateral is. Quad means four, lateral means side. A parallelogram is a quadrilateral, so it has that quality. It's a polygon with four sides. It also has an additional quality that it has two sets of parallel sides that are the same length. So what that means is this side and this side are the same length, and then this side and this side are the same length. So um, two sets of parallel sides, same length, uh, but not necessarily the same length as each other. So that's a parallelogram. These circles here, they're inside the parallelogram circle. So you can say that every rectangle, square, and rhombus is also a parallelogram. That's true. What's different about a rectangle is that it has all 90 degree angles. Rect means right angle, angle, right angles. So this is the right angled par parallelogram. What's different about a rhombus it doesn't have anything to do with the angles. It's just that all four sides are the same length. And then a square has all of those qualities. In fact, a square is a quadrilateral because it's a polygon with four sides. It's a parallelogram because it has two sets of parallel sides that are same length. And it has all 90 degree angles. And all four sides are the same length. So this is sort of uh, your everything bagel right here. All right, so let's look at some problems now in classifying quadrilaterals and see if we can uh, uh, use this information. So we've got just four true or false questions here. This one says every square is a rectangle. And if we go back to our diagram, here's a square. It's inside the rectangle circle. So yes, every square is a rectangle. A square is just a rectangle that has all its sides the same length. This one says every quadrilateral is a rhombus. <clears throat> well, that's not true. Every rhombus is a quadrilateral, but not every quadrilateral is a rhombus. Then this one says every rhombus is a parallelogram. Let's go back to our diagram. So here's the rhombus. It's inside the parallelogram circle. So yeah, every rhombus has to be a parallelogram. So that is true. And then it says every rhombus with four right angles is a square. And if you look at our diagram, that really is um, the definition of a square. It's a rhombus and it's a rectangle, which means it has four right angles. So that one is true as well. So that is a little bit of work with classifying quadrilaterals.